Hello there, how are you doing? Now in this section, you're going to learn about the basics of React. Now before we combine React with the Laravel, it's a good practice to just learn React on its own. It's going to be pretty similar, but this will uh, be a bit easier to learn, okay? So let's begin by installing React. The first thing, you need to make sure that you have Node installed, okay? So if you don't have Node installed in your computer, you can simply go to nodejs.org and you can download either for Mac or Windows okay so once you do that if you go to your terminal terminal you can type node-v for node version and you will see the node version so if you see this that means you have node installed in your computer so once you have that what we can do is we can go to reactjs.org and we just need to install react using let me go through get started let's go to installation Okay, we can use CDN links as well, but obviously you wouldn't use that. So let's go do it straight away. So what you can do is we can install this create react app. It is the best way to start building new react application, single page applications. Okay, so we just need to run this command. So this will install this create react app globally dash Z. Okay, so let's go and paste that command and hit enter okay i get this error i just need to run sudo okay so once that is done we are ready to create new react projects just by running this command create react app and the name whatever you like to call it okay so let's begin now before we do anything let's decide where we want to create this application right so you might want to create on your desktop or some folders you can create anywhere because we have installed this globally so it is available anywhere in your computer okay so what i'm going to do is i have a couple of folders in my root directory and there is one called react so if you don't have you can create one in your root okay so let's go let's change the directory cd into react list all the files so i have all these files i'm going to create one more so this time using this command that we just installed create react app let's name it what do we call it let's say la react okay let's do that so it will take some time so once it is done i'll be back okay so once it is done you'll get this uh, beautiful uh, messages here you can run yarn start to start the application yarn build to build this application before you deploy it to your production okay if you're running the test you can use this yarn test and if you run this yarn eject what it will do is this create react app is a uh, the kind of a packaged well packaged system so if you want to break it out you would run yarn eject okay so you might not want to do that and then since we have this already installed we can cd into la react okay cd into there and then we can run this application using this yarn start now everywhere you see yarn you can simply use npm as well okay so npm or yarn whichever you prefer okay so let's cd into this one and then let's say yarn start or you can use npm start as well okay so once you do that this will open now i have already another application running so it is asking me to another port i'll just hit enter okay and 
and there we have our freshly installed react application okay so in this video we just installed react now in the next video let's have a look inside this directory let's introduce ourselves into files and folder structures okay so let's do that in the next video thank you